Good morning, everybody. How are you today? We are going to get started on our morning meeting in our calendar. We are still in the month of May. May. Let's start with our good morning song. Two hands. Two fingers. Let's get started. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? How are you? Very well, thank you. Very well, thank you. How about you? How about you? Very good, you guys. So the last time that we had school was Friday. On Friday we had school and it was the number 15 and we colored the box pink. It was Friday, May 15. We did not come to school on Saturday, which was the number 16 in yellow. We did not come to school on Sunday, 17, and the box is green. So if yesterday was Sunday, today is... Mm, oh, I heard some of you. I heard it. Monday. Very good. Today is Monday. Now, yesterday we had the number 17. Does anybody know what number comes next? If yesterday was 17, a 1 and a 7, what number is next? Should we find out by counting? Let's count together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Very good. 18. And to write the number 18, you need a 1 and an 8 together to make 18. Now that we know the number, we have to pick out our pattern color. So yesterday we had the color green. If we look at our pattern, what is the next color after green? Is it pink? Mm-hmm, you guys are right, it is pink. So Miss Sarah's got a color in her box pink. Now is Miss Sarah going crazy? No, she's not. She's not going crazy. She colored that in nicely. All right, let's save the date. Repeat after me. Today is Monday, May 18, 2020. Very good. Today is Monday. Today is Monday. All day long. Woo! All day long. Woo! Yesterday was Sunday. Tomorrow will be Tuesday. Ding dong, ding, ding dong, ding. Very good. Now let's look at our days of the week. There are seven days in the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Seven days. Seven days. Seven days in the week. Very good, you guys. Now let's quickly talk about what our lesson plan is for today. So today on our lesson plan, we are going to use the letter flash cards, or you can use what we have here on our lesson plan, the letters. And you are going to go around your house and find objects that begin with this sound. So today's sounds are eh, 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 t, t, e, p, and n. So when I look for the p sound, I can use this. This is a pen. P, 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 pen. Okay, or T for the t, t, t sound, I can use this. It's a telephone, right? T, t, t. 
So that's what we're going to do today for literacy, as well as having your child write their first and last name. For math today, we are going to do the similar, similar to what we did last week, practice counting objects up to 15. If your child is struggling to count to 15, focus on counting to 10, and then do one or two with them counting to 15. It is important that they are able to state how many they have counted when they are done counting. For science and social studies today, we are talking about parts of the body. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, our insides, our heart, our lungs, our stomachs, what those body parts do for us. Today for recess, we are doing 10 minutes of quiet time activity. Really just taking that time to focus on yourself, be quiet, relax. For social emotional, you guys are gonna create another rule for your household. You can keep it the same rule that you made last week and continue in working on it. Make sure you set expectations for when you want them to do it and how you want your child to do that rule. As always, if you need anything, please reach out to me or Miss Lily. We are always here for you. It is very important that you communicate with us. Even if you cannot get on our virtual teaching sessions, we completely understand. Please reach out to us if you need anything. Let us know that you guys are healthy healthy and safe. That is the number one importance right now. Have a great Monday.